Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is the Face of Star Just and welcome back to Metro hey, Last Light. Redux, this is the Corbett level. Artyom, look, and my name is the Face of Star Just. But as a soldier, you understand that I had to follow my orders and bring you here, okay? Now you're under arrest, but perhaps it's not the end of the line for you. I hope. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. At ease, Tavarish. So, you're doing good here? Are you not? Yes, sir. Comrade Moskvin is here, inspecting the troops. The Secretary General? Here? What about Comrade Corbin? Yes, sir. Comrade General is here, too. Opa, it's my lucky day, huh? Okay, things are moving faster than we anticipated. Look, Artyom, you're a smart guy, so we understand there is no such thing as coincidence. You are here because we need you. Information. So, mm -hmm. my advice to you, my friend? Cooperate. Okay? But don't worry, I got your back. Because we are what? Musketeers! All for one, and one for all. But your comrades in the order, their motto is all for us. War is coming, my friend. That bunker you guys found, whoever controls it survives and fuck the rest of us. But we have been preparing for this. And I want you to join us. Um, makes sense. Mm-hmm. I was captured, Comrade Corbett. This ranger here, uh, saved me. What a coincidence. He's Nitsky, one of the Spartan Rangers. You know this man? Yes, sir. His name is Artyom. Miller trusts him. They found the six together. He's also earned several commendations since officially enlisting with the Order. Mm-hmm. Well, I am overjoyed to meet you, Comrade Artyom. I think we both have something to offer. Take the comrade to the negotiation room. God damn. So that's what happened to Miller. He was a red sleeping agent. Let's dispense with the introductory probing and cut the chase. This telepathic mutant, the so called is of extreme scientific significance. Tell me all you know about it, and I will allow you to keep your life and your job with the Rangers. But, as my spy, an operative, just like those uh, musketeers. One for all, and all for... Secretary General Comrade Moskvin. Corbut, I need a moment. And what do we have? Mm -hmm. Another enemy of the revolution? <laughs> Perfect. As you have always noted, Lonya must start learning how to improve his uh, people skills. As a matter of fact, we were. Ah, put away your truth serums. I'll show you a more traditional Red Army method. Faster and more effective. You shit! Spill your guts now! Tell everything you know of these six! <laughs> Oh. Fuck. Still nothing, huh? <laughs> okay, bitch! You talk, or I'll fry your balls in pig fat! Passwords, code names, operation protocols! What are you doing, Dad? This is called interrogation, Lonya. Interrogation. Business as usual. What? You never did that playing dolls? No! You little shit! There's no <laughs> without blood! There is! Your brother ruled peacefully, and they still love him! Get back here! You're a thug. God damn it! Butcher. All right. Use your drugs. Use hot pokers. Just get everything out of him and shoot the bastard. And then come to my office. We must talk. Okay. I must agree with Leonid. Brutality is a crooked path to information. I believe in science. One injection and you will tell us everything. Hmm. I don't think I will.
So the a dark one saved us. Interesting. I need you to go to Venice and take care of the locals who made the delivery. This will not be a cash payment. Understand? Completely, sir. And uh, what about the dark one? The creature has been located. The details are in this envelope. Mm -hmm. You will pick up the animal right after you go to Venice. Don't disappoint me this time. I won't, Comrade General. I, uh, I won't. Goddamn piece of shit. Fuck Corbett. Fuck my father. And Morozov. And the revolution and my own future. I'd rather be shot and end up like father. Killing his own brother. Listen. If you get out of here, just, well, just live! Here! Get in there! This is the way to freedom. Believe me, I know. <laughs> I spent all my childhood hiding from my father in those vents. Mm. Well, good luck to you! Okay, thank you so very much. Let's actually get the freak out of here. Okay, I believe this is still the Corbot level. We should actually be finishing up the level. Let's talk about the negotiations in police. Ah, so you already know. I am the head of intelligence after all. Mm -hmm. Why did you let the information leak? Damn the refugees. Polis, Hansa. And even the fucking Nazis already know about our plans. The rats will be exterminated. And war is inevitable anyway. Inevitable? I have my doubts. So does the Politburo. A doubtful man mm -hmm. is a fearful man. How dare you? You're the head of state security and you report to me. Yes, but now, when we are one step away from a unified red metro, you have no right to disrupt the plan. I have no right? I'm... Moscovin, when you asked me how to deal with your elder brother when he was still the Secretary General, mm -hmm. I helped you. And after his tragic death, I backed your takeover. So I suggest you take my advice again. This is unacceptable. It's very simple, Comrade Moskvin. We all stand together, arms linked against the wind. Or it's every man for himself. But, Corbett, is this whole fucking metro truly worth the blood we're going to spill? I have a way of doing it without spilling any blood. No blood, you say? All right. Go do your trick. I'll handle the Politburo. Okay. So they have a method of ending the war without any blood. The frontal assault is hopeless, but if we go underground to the church, advance through the catacombs, then attack from the rear, we should encounter little or no resistance. Then we just have to do a sweep. Attention, comrade general, soldiers, you are trusted mm -hmm. with an important mission. Each group has its task, and you have been told only what you need to know to succeed. But remember that this operation is top secret and you must not be taken alive by the enemy i hope that i am understood questions can we use radios after we capture the assigned targets only in case of emergency and on a scrambled frequency if we're faced with strong enemy counterattacks, do we hold the positions or fall back hold them mm -hmm. anyway the enemy is unlikely to mount an effective counteroffensive. comrade general we have been issued a banner along with the other gear, but we were also made to remove all our markings. We have a real <coughs> purpose of our operation. Only upon victory, the receipt of the following signal, will you raise your banner over the captured targets. Are the questions? No, Comrade General. Good luck, Surrender! 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 Surrender!